Key Stage 1, I find it really useful to use puppets at the open forum stage. Children respond far more positively and openly and warmly to a puppet speaking than they do to a boring adult. It's so much better if the puppet has the problems and the puppet has the questions and their answers just flow back naturally. And then the puppet often has questions they need to ask and they have little problems and the children give advice straight away to the puppets. So what they're learning is that they have some really good advice inside them and it's not a short time away before they start to give advice to each other. So do you want to come out and have a little word with the children? Oh, I'm a little bit shy. Don't be shy, Sort, because they're very good and they're very... They're, they listen to you, they don't shout out. Don't be shy, come on now. He's coming. Ooh. You are children. I've always wondered about children. I've heard children have got big thinking skills. At this point, I wanted all the children to contribute. And this is when I use a speaking object, in this case a papier-mâché egg, for the children to do a round. I got Salt to ask if the children could think of all the different types of animals that might be in his animal school. Now, Mrs. Mosley, when the children hold the egg, you mustn't interrupt them because when children hold an egg to speak, the teacher mustn't say anything. So, Mrs. Mosley, if you have to interrupt them, touch the egg and say sorry. All right, children, I'll try hard not to interrupt you. Okay, can you take that now? And what animal do you think's in my school? Rabbit. <laughs> In this way, each child hears just one word and helps to break the silence of the circle. This is warming them up for when they'll speak more directly in the open forum phase.